What's going on guys? Welcome to another video and in today's video we are reviewing the Spyderco Paramilitary 3. Let's get into the video. I know, times are tough. It seems that 2022 is just the cousin of 2021 and 2021 was the cousin of 2020. But there is a bright light. Well, in this case, a dark knife. So, no, it's not a Batman reference. It is not the Dark Knight. It is this black on black Spyderco Paramilitary 3. This is a three inch blade, friction lock, as you could hear. Um, not spring assisted, which is okay. Some people do like that, but I am okay with just the friction lock. Now, what makes this knife the perfect pocket knife? Well, besides its overall length of um, 2.93 inches for the blade, uh, this is pretty much perfect for anything you can use. I've had this knife for about two years now. As you can see, the black on black matte finish is not rubbing off, except for a little bit of wear here on the tip, and you can see some scratches on both sides of the blade. That finish isn't coming off. And I'm using this all the time, opening boxes, when I go fishing, whatever I needed to do, this blade does it. Now, on the back of the blade, you do get these serrations. These help you um, have grip, and you also have one, some serrations right here. And so those serrations um, are going to help you when you are cutting anything to just give you that little bit of extra grip. If you cut fish like I do for cut bait, you will get blood on your knives, and that's very slippery. And I've never had any slippage onto the blade or a loss of the blade in my hand due to these extra serrations that just really help it lock into your hand. Now, this blade does come with these black rivets on it. I've never had any of these come loose. The only silver is going to be your lock here on the back and the pivot pin. So, the way you activate the knife is you stick whatever finger you want into this hole to flick it open. You're just doing this thumbs up motion, this flicking motion with your thumb. Just stick your thumb into the hole and then there you go. Activated knife. It's quick, you got that nice crisp lock, and I just love it. Now, to close it, you just push this pin or this bar over, as you can see, and then that knife will just fold right back on in. Once it's locked, this thing isn't folding back in. I know on some cheaper knives, that is a problem where the blade can't come back down on you if it gets bent or the bar gets messed up. I've never had this bar mess up. I've had some other knives where the bar gets bent out of shape and it's hard to open and close, but this one I've never had a problem with. The pocket clip is a great pocket clip. I've never had it bend out on me. Um, if it would bend out, I, you can probably buy replacements. I'm not completely sure if you can, but I would imagine that you can. And it's swappable, so you can put it for whatever hand orientation you have, if you're a lefty or a righty. And then it also comes with this lanyard hole. So you can tie it around your uh, neck, hang it off your keychain, however you like to carry. This knife will do it. This knife is the plain edged version, um, high carbon steel. And you know what, guys? This thing is, you know, American made. Just really enjoy Spyderco knives. And for the black on black version, which you see here, this is going to run you about 120 bucks. So if you need a good Christmas gift idea, I know the Christmas season is over. Valentine's Day is coming up. If you know somebody that needs a knife and you love them, consider getting the Spyderco Paramilitary 3. Now, there are links down in the description where you guys can find this knife. If you guys found this video helpful in any sort of way, please go down there and buy one for somebody. Give this video a like, share, comment, and subscribe. I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.